Estonian Rural Development Programme includes uh, financial instruments uh, with a budget of 36 million euros. Uh, we are using financial instruments uh, uh, in three measures. These are uh, performance of agricultural holdings, processing and marketing, and also diversification. And we have two uh, types of financial instruments, uh, growth loan and long-term investment loan. We already have uh, 82 uh, projects approved. Uh, with these 82 projects, uh, almost half of the money of the financial instruments is in use. The applicants themselves are planning to create 173 new jobs. The Exante assessment was really helpful in mapping the market failure. Uh, what we saw from the uh, Exante assessment is that uh, SMEs, also starting enterprises, uh, certain sectors have difficulties uh, obtaining loans. Also rural enterprises and agriculture sector don't have uh, sufficient uh, guarantees and there are no long-term uh, loans available on the market. Rural Development Foundation is a financial intermediary. We have uh, provided different financial services uh, to rural areas more than 20 years. Uh, we are self-sufficient organizations, but we are state-owned. The type of projects we are invest to are, are modernize production, improve resource efficiency, and of course, uh, uh, increase competitiveness. Financial instruments is not free money. It means responsibility. It has to be paid back, but it also uh, results in higher quality projects. 90% of beneficiaries are micro-enterprises but we are especially focusing on young farmers, producer groups and also startups. We have uh, invested now more than 80 projects from uh, windmills to uh, bakeries, from CNC metal cutting machines into goat farming. So it's a wide variety of businesses. We heard about it from uh, Estonia Rural Development uh, Foundation uh, when they came to introduce their plans for the future. So it was a great opportunity for us. The loan uh, gave us opportunity to buy new technology like hay drying uh, machine, uh, milking station and uh, dairy equ equipment. This uh, milking station is uh, most advanced in Estonia. The technology made us more efficient. We only have two workers. Before Estonia had to import uh, goat milk, but now we can say, uh, sell uh, raw and pasteurized uh, goat milk all over Estonia. A uh, financial instrument is uh, more beneficial in three ways. It uh, helps to lower the pressure on grants, where the demand is high but the resources are limited. Uh, secondly, it's uh, more flexible. Uh, it uh, uh, enables farmers to apply for loan whenever it is needed. It also enables uh, uh, to target uh, wider range of uh, enterprises and thirdly uh, it forces farmers uh, to think uh, their business plan and uh, risks more for investments financed by loans are more carefully calculated and also they can lead to more efficient uh, investments. Trades can be used as a tool for policy making for example in the rural areas when we have shortage of uh, women entrepreneurs. We can use uh, subsidized interest to promote uh, women entrepreneurship. At first uh, when we started to negotiate with the uh, banks we had several de declines because uh, we are young, we have new experience, new history uh, and uh, we had to prove that our business plan is good. When we applied for the loan there was less red tape because we only have had to apply once uh, to one place. We have uh, made loan decisions around 18 million at the moment, but it has also generated another 18 million from the commercial banks. So it means it's a double money for those projects. 
good thing about uh, loans is that the money is coming back and you can use it again and again. For example, our foundation's 36 million euro budget is used for investments in rural area in amount of 800 million euros in the last 20 years. We have long-term contract with the banks and in a way banks are the best promoters of financial instruments. If they don't want to make a loan deal with a farmer, they send the farmer to us and we'll try to find the best solution for them.